Hey everyone, I thought I'd do a quick video about how I run a whatnot sale and not be on camera. So if you're doing, um, you know, hard goods, smalls, and um, you need to have the item up close to the camera and or you don't want to be on camera, <laughs> this is an easy setup. So I just have my um, tripod stand here. It has a light and this is a nice heavy base. If you use those, you know, kind of weak little crinkly adjustable um, tripods, they usually won't work. This is nice and heavy and it will hold my phone. My phone will go here vertically and then there's my shooting area. The only purpose of the phone during the sale is the camera. Otherwise, I'm not touching buttons. I'm not doing anything other than using it as a camera. My laptop is right next to me. I will sit here. My laptop's next to me. The laptop is where I run everything during the sale. So the camera's here, and then on my computer, on the WhatNot site, um, in the sale, I am pinning items, running the auctions, doing the giveaways. All the things are on the laptop. So again, phone is just your camera. You wanna have another device. It's just so much easier than trying to run everything off your phone while your phone is your camera. I have a light there for some extra lighting. <laughs> I put this big ruler up in the back just so people can get an idea of scale. And then uh, tonight I'm doing Squishmallow sale, uh, which will be over by the time you guys see this video. But um, you can see that I have everything laid out in order uh, as I'm going to run it. So I have my catalog numbered. If you number your items, whatnot will keep them in the numerical order. So I number. So I've got one, two, three, four, five. Here we go all through the thing so I can grab them. Now, if I was doing something um, like smalls and a bunch of different stuff, I would use the bag system, which Misty has <laughs> told us about. So um, just Ziploc bags with numbers and then the number would correspond to the auction and then I would just be able to grab the bag, run the item and then put it back in the bag after the auction and move on to the next bag. What I do after the item has run is I put it in a tote. I've got two totes right next to me here. If I was doing the bag, I would pull the bag, take the item out of the bag, run it here while using the computer to do the back end work. And then when that auction item was over, I would put it back in the numbered bag and I would put the bag in the tote. Tonight when I run it, like after I do Olaf, I'll put Olaf here, I'll show him for, a second, pin the item, talk about them just 10, 15 seconds at most, run the auction, and then when that auction is over and someone has purchased Olaf, Olaf will go into the tote. I don't have to put these in bags because I only have one of each thing and I can tell what I did. So like I've got two of these Twizzlers, but one's a five inch, one's, I think this is a nine inch. So I put as much information in the description as I can to not only give buyers as much information as possible before the show so they can maybe pre-bid but also at the in the end I can keep track like I said again the only duplicate well it, and it's not a duplicate but it's the only like Twizzlers I think is the only one everything else kind of has its own particular name and look so um this one will be an easy one like well I have Reese's but this one's a five inch that one's a nine inch it's obviously uh, different characters, but that just keeps organized. But otherwise, the bag method. So I have a reseller supply link in my store, but I'll just go ahead and link this tripod. Um, someone else on TikTok I saw actually had one and it's like $70, but honestly, it is so worth it because it is going to hold your camera tight and it's not going to be the worst thing are sales where the camera's jiggling or people are literally just holding their phone and then move and everything around. No, you want your camera steady. So this tripod for your phone, I love it. Um, I'll link it below. And I, like I said, I have this light, any light, we'll do put a little lamp here. Um, and then the laptop is where I run everything for the sale. Um, so I hope that helps those of you who are interested in how to do um, a sale, not being on camera, and also needing a better system to hold your phone, um, two devices. It's it's just so much easier when you have your phone as the camera and a computer to run the sale. So 
easy setup. I feel this is just a banquet table that I've moved into my office here, um, but this will hold a lot. So hope that helps you guys. If it did, be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe for more reselling content and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.